everyone, so today I'm going to be talking about Butter London nail polishes. And I got these from a sale online. I think it was Aussie sale or some kind of sale where they do like limited edition sales. And they were selling these for like 10 to $14. So I had to jump on the bandwagon and get some Butter London. I got five Butter London nail polishes and I have been loving them lately. So today I'm going to be doing a review on basically how they apply. I'll be showing you tutorials on how you apply them and also how pigmented they are and how nicely they glide on your nails. So I will show you the five colors I have and show you little tutorials and previews about why exactly I have fallen in love with them. The first one is called Yummy Mummy and this one is a really pretty taupe brown sand color. I'm actually wearing on my nails right now so you can see it's a really nice nude color. It's great for fall winter which is the season right now in Australia which is why I have my nice jumper on. I love this color. It's very beachy, it's very sand, it's very nude and when you apply it you can see that the first coat is already quite pigmented. Again, it is a nude color, so it's supposed to match with your skin tone. And then when you apply further coats, you can see just how pretty it is. It has actually a really nice matte subtle finish to it. You kind of don't get anywhere else. And I just really like it because it's a beach nude color, great for fall and winter. And it's definitely one of my favorites. I love the packaging of the Butter London nail polishes because they come in sort of a square packaging just like this, but then you kind of lift the thing up. It says actually, lift to open and you can actually get the bottle nail polish. So when you open it up, it's just a normal screw top. The brush is kind of small though, compared to OPI nail polishes and other nail polishes that I've tried, the brush is a little bit small, but that is kind of good if you have small nails, but it is somewhat slower to paint. This is one of my ultimate favorite nail polishes in my whole collection, and this is Butter London in Chancer. Chancer is just a ridiculously gorgeous red color glitter, and when I first sort of saw it online, I thought that it wasn't gonna have a base color. I thought it was just gonna be red glitter onto my nails and then I'd have to paint another base color to sort of enhance the look but I really don't have to because it does come with a base color it's a translucent red but when you apply multiple coats of it you just need to it becomes the most beautiful ruby red glitter gem kind of nail polish that you can ever lay your eyes on and when I saw it it just kind of looks like ruby nail polish it's just so beautiful I think the camera doesn't do it justice but it is absolutely the best glitter nail polish in the whole wide world. You really have to, you know, Chancer is just, just gorgeous. When you first apply it, the, the pigmentation is already there. You apply your second color and you're basically set to go. Whereas you have to layer it on, but with this, you kind of just need two coats and you're really all set to go. It is one of my favorite all-time red glitter nail polishes in the world. This is a beautiful hot pink. So as you know, hot pink is basically my favorite color in the whole wide world, just because it's like, feminine but at the same time it's like rare and this is called primrose hill picnic which is just a really pretty gorgeous bright pink color i have a few bright pinks in my nail polish collection but i don't have that standard classic bright pink and this really just does that it's a beautiful hot pink color it is kind of dark like i was kind of upset about the color because i was kind of expecting it to be a little lighter when I applied it, but when I applied it, it kind of appears a little darker, which doesn't really match my skin tone, as you can see from the video, but then it is still really nice, high quality nail polish. We need two coats, but you know, you can stop at one coat as well. So this is a beautiful hot pink color. I wouldn't say that it's my favorite Butter London nail polishes, just because it doesn't really match my skin tone as well as I thought it would, but overall, it's still a high quality, pretty and hot pink nail polish. This nail polish is called Knees Up. And as you can see, it kind of reminds me of the tin foil nail wrapping. You kind of wrap your Christmas presents and it's in that like red foil. It is just the exact same color. And when you apply it on your nails, it is the most beautiful red foil color you can ever imagine. It's like you took those nail wraps, those nail foil wraps, and then you kind of just stuck it, stuck them on your nails. That's what it looks like. It just looks fake almost. So the color is just amazing. It is very true to the color of the bottle, which is kind of rare. Because you kind of need just one coat and you're basically set to go. I always double up my coats just in case. So for, for staying power reasons, but I have found that all the also these Butter London nail polishes dry very quickly. So I hate having to wait for my nails. It is like the pet peeve of mine to wait for my nail polish to dry because I am very impatient and I just have, I like, the least favorite part of my manicure is just waiting for my nails to dry under the nail dryer. These nail polishes actually dry faster than OPI and faster than China Glaze and Essie, which I will do reviews on later on, but I just love these. I think they pride themselves on being three free nail lacquer, which means it's free of 
Formaldehyde, toluene, and DPB. Color, not carcinogens. And they're from London. Butter London and Seattle, Washington. The last nail polish that I have from Butter London is called Henley Regatta. And I've been really kind of into trying glitter nail polishes lately because I've seen so many sort of Instagram photos and people layering different glitter on their nails and being all sparkly. And I realized that that's not really the best look for daytime when you're studying and stuff like that. It's kind of distracting. But I've been sort of looking at that. So when I went to buy the Butter London nail polishes on the online site, I was like looking through them and I was like kind of really spotting the glitter nail polishes as you can see from Chancer and Henley Regatta. And Henley Regatta is just a beautiful green, turquoise, almost peacock looking glitter nail polish and it has like blue and green glitter in it. Now unlike Chancer, which had the base red color, this one does not have any. So it has just a clear base coat. So when you do apply it, you will have to apply more than a mul more than multiple coats of the nail polish to get the same color you get in the bottle, but you only need three coats. Whereas some other nail polishes, you kind of need like four or five coats to get that heavy glitter nail polish look. But with this, you kind of need three coats and you're basically done. This is such a beautiful color. The glitter particles are just right. They're not like super chunky and they go all over the place. They stick on fine. Let's finish up with another top coat and you're basically done. As you can see from the video, it's just a beautiful color. It's peacock, blue, green at the same time, but more green. It kind of reminds me of being a mermaid. Like I put on Instagram, I was like doing swatches of all the nail polishes and then I was like, I feel like a mermaid because <laughs> this is just such a beautiful color. And it kind of matches this, not really. Hmm. So that is my Butter London nail polish review. I hope you like my review, little tutorials in between. I hope they were helpful as well. So if you have any chance of getting Butter London, you really should try it out. It's definitely one of my favorite nail polish brands in the whole history of the world. And I'll see you guys later. Bye.